This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals, and the lesson I'm working on is Forward Loops with Artist Puzzle 2. All right, free lab, free play. Experiment with the for loop and the counter variable. Drag out a few blocks and see what happens. Oh, okay, cool. Let's see here. I recognize this from the last one. So for loop, 1 to 100, and we're counting by 10. So we'll start at 1, and we'll count up by 10 until we reach 100. Okay. Well, that's really only going to be like 10 times, right? Because 10, 20, 30, oh well, we'll leave it. Okay, what should I do here? I'll move forward by... Ooh, that's going to be weird. I'll move forward by whatever counter is equal to. Okay. And then... I'm going to set a random color each time it runs. And then I'm going to turn... I have no idea. This probably is just going to go off the screen. Let's see. <laughs> okay, I find that very entertaining. So it's 1 to 100, and it counts up by 10. Okay? So what if we did 1 to 200? That might go off the screen. We'll definitely draw more. We'll draw 20 lines. Let's try. So it's getting larger and larger, right? Because we're adding 10 each time. That's kind of fun. Now, that's actually cool. Okay. And using the for loop, we can make all sorts of cool randomness drawings. Um, well, not always random because we're controlling it by the variable counter. Regardless, I'm excited to see what we're going to be doing in this lesson. Let's uh, keep going.